On November 14th, Bobby Gore was arrested on a murder charge, an accusation which he denies to this day. There was a fight broke out one night. A guy got killed out there. OK, they found out I was in the area. When they finished, I was the one that committed the murder. I was sentenced to 25 to 40 years for something that I didn't do. And, you know, God's going to be my witness. He knows exactly what happened. I didn't do that. Gore served 10 years until he made parole in 1979. But his incarceration, combined with the drying up of both private and public funds, proved too much for the conservative vice lords to withstand. New leaders were unable to keep the tenuous peace. Within a year of Gore's prison term, Lawndale and everything the vice lords and David Dolly worked for had crumbled. We screwed ourselves somewhat because had it not been for guys doing dumb shit, stupid expression, they wouldn't have the excuse to pounce on us like they did. Before I went to prison, the state of the vice lords was first. By the time I got out, everything was gone. When I hit 16th Street in Lawndale, I looked at what was going on and how many of my friends I had lost. Couldn't do nothing but cry. You know, it was just rough. Kind of hard to believe, you know?